Vernier calipers. The main parts of vernier calipers are inner measuring jaws, outer measuring jaws, vernier scale, retainer, main scale, depth measuring prong. Aim to find the volume of a small spear, cylinder, beaker and a rectangular block by measuring its associated dimensions. First, we have to determine the least count of the given vernier calipers. One mean scale division is equal to 1 mm. One vernier scale division is equal to 0.9 mm. Least count LC is equal to 1 MSD minus 1 VSD equal to 1 minus 0.9 mm that is equal to 0.1 mm which equals to 0.01 cm. Check for the zero error. Here, no error is visible as the zero division of the main scale coincides with the zero of the vernier scale. Spear Materials required Vernier calipers and a spear Take the vernier calipers. The spear to be measured is placed in between the outer measuring jaws and hold it tight. Note the main scale reading and vernier scale reading. Calculation Total reading is equal to N plus N into least count. Total reading TR is equal to 2.1 plus 7 into 0 0.01 which equals to 2.17 centimeters. Volume of the spear V is equal to 4 by 3 pi into D by 2 the whole cube. V is equal to 4 by 3 pi into 2.17 divided by 2 the whole cube which is equal to 5.3476 cm cube. Beaker Materials required Vernier calipers and a beaker Take the vernier calipers and the beaker. Place the beaker upside down over the internal measuring jaws and fix it tight. Note down the main scale reading and the vernier scale reading. Calculation TR is equal to MSR plus VSR into least count which is equal to 3.5 plus 2 into 0 0.01. That equals 3.52 cm, that is D is equal to 3.52 cm. Release the beaker from the jaws of the vernier calipers and place it at the end to extend the depth measuring prong through the beaker till it touches its bottom and note the MSR and VSR readings. Calculation TR is equal to MSR plus VSR into least count which is equal to 5.4 plus 8 into 0 0.01 that equals 5.48 cm that is D is equal to 5.48 cm volume of the beaker V is equal to pi into D by 2 the whole square into D that is equal to 3.14 into 3.52 divided by 2 the whole square into 5.48 which is equal to 53.30102 cm3. Cylinder Materials required Vernier calipers and a cylinder Take the vernier calipers and the cylinder. Place the cylinder between the outer measuring jaws widthwise to measure its diameter. Note its MSR and VSR readings. Calculation TR is equal to MSR plus VSR into least count that is equal to 2.3 plus 7 into 0 0.01 which is equal to 2.37 cm that is D is equal to 2.37 cm. Now place the cylinder lengthwise in between the outer measuring jaws of the vernier calipers and note its MSR and VSR readings. Calculation TR is equal to MSR plus VSR into least count that is equal to 4.1 plus 6 into 0 0.01 
which is equal to 4.16 cm. That is L is equal to 4.16 cm. Volume of the cylinder V is equal to pi into D by 2 the whole square into L. That is equal to 3.14 into 2.37 divided by 2 the whole square into 4.16 which is equal to 18.343 cm3. Rectangular block Materials required Vernier calipers and a rectangular block Place the rectangular block lengthwise in between the outer measuring jaws of the vernier calipers and note its MSR and VSR readings. Calculation TR is equal to MSR plus VSR into least count. That is equal to 7.2 plus 4 into 0 0.01 which is equal to 7.24 cm. Now place the rectangular block breadthwise in between the outer measuring jaws of the vernier calipers and note the MSR and VSR reading. Calculation TR is equal to MSR plus VSR into least count. That is equal to 3.8 plus 5 into 0 0.01 which is equal to 3.85 cm. Then place the rectangular block heightwise in between the outer measuring jaws of the vernier calipers and note the MSR and VSR reading. Calculation TR is equal to MSR plus VSR into least count. That is equal to 2.4 plus 9 into 0 0.01 which is equal to 2.49 cm. Volume of the rectangular block V is equal to L into B into H. So V is equal to 7.24 into 3.85 into 2.49, which is equal to 69.40626 cm3.